We got London on the track Shit, I'm here for I'm young and been gone Bitch, no, we still scoring Yeah, yeah, still missing Dottie Banging that little quiz Turn me up Mess. We got a lot of cleaning up to do. Every time we come back here, we always bring the blower, but they just cut the grass. And this is the start of the eighth mile right here. I feel like I'm at the dirt track, like prepping this freaking street. I mean, we really could. We don't have to run both lanes today. We really could just run one, one lane. Cause some of that grass looks like it's wet. Don't, like, don't, wanna, don't wanna come off. Huh? Definitely don't look like we're running both lanes cause that whole lane just took almost all the battery. So we're just gonna have to run one lane at a time, one bag at a time. So guys, this is the first time we've been out here since topside of Oak Mode. Dropped the piston. 421 hadn't been out here in so long. Been months. And here goes Danny. Both motors are brand new, pretty much fresh. Fully built by us. 421 alcohol, 485 on alcohol. We got all the goodies now. We got the straight cuts. Clutches are all fresh. Brand new Hoosier tires on both bikes. Titanium rear end. Gotta check out the 421. Fully drag ported by us. The bike weighs 203 pounds as it sits. With gas in it, with oil in it, everything. Tires on, everything. With 44 electrons, full race tech titanium rear end. That thing weighs six pounds. JJ and a gun drill drag axle. We got an 18 by 10 by eight slick on it with an eight by 10 wheel. Some shear pipes as far as the timing wise and as far as the power jet wise we don't know where we're at right now but we got the meter and rod kind of where we want it you'll hear when we start it up it's chopping pretty good so the low end sounds fine but um the orange bike y'all top side still kind of the same thing last time this bike was out here it blew up 50 feet before the finish line what huh, jordan you were on it yeah about, about 50 60 feet and it did 89 miles an hour rolling through the finish line and it still ran a 6.3 our objective is to get them tuned right out here today we got a lot of tuning so we're gonna take y'all uh we're gonna let y'all see kind of if we have any struggles, I don't know what's gonna happen. If we're gonna, both clean, bikes we're, same we're gonna clean that second lane. Well, we're gonna get all down. The electric blower got one battery, so you're gonna have to push from it or something. I'm not scared. Yeah. All right, guys. So we're not. I'm not sure how this is gonna go at all. We got the draggy here, right here for the time. Trying to hear the motor, see how it does. Uh, listens for a sputter because we only we turn the power jets in a, a turn and a half, so just to lean it out a little bit. This is no prep. About three pounds of air pressure in the tires. I got way too much gear on it with this little motor. It spun out of that first gear pretty good. Bogged. Soon I sipped in the second. And it was tacked up. The motor was tacked up. Ramped out high. And it bogged. So I think if we drop down a tooth in that front sprocket, I think we'll be uh, pretty close. It's lazy on the top end too. I can float that power jet. And the RPMs at first spun, shifting a second, it bogged. No, nah, it's got way too much gear in it. We put an 18 on the front. I wanted to buy a 34, but nobody had it. So Angel was like, I got a 32 right now, or you can wait for the 34. I was like, give me a 32, I'll try it. And that's what it's on that bike. I mean, I don't reckon they're gonna be far off in gearing, so chains reckon. loose, I don't reckon. <laughs> so we might as well just put the 18 on both bikes. <laughs> Contest, we will win. Look like eight to me. We're gonna back down the tower. 
You want fresh plug? Let's do that. Just to be, be on a safe side. Yeah. pulled the wheels. No, you saw his little burn out? You saw his hook? I left. Boy, well, yeah, I felt the hook. I should have been a second. If we had the right gear, it's gonna pull a wheelie in a second. Like, it, it hooked. Like, you can feel the tire right now. Like, it's stick hot. You saw that burn out, dude. It was, it, I'm telling you. So we just dropped it down five tenths of a second from doing a burn out. But it, it's not doing what it should do because of the gear. We're not close to the gear. So, I mean, dude, that's, that's working with something. The, the plugs haven't been having a burn mark on it. So, like, the plugs look like they're brand new. Like, literally, it doesn't have any heat mark on it, so it's still rich. So, I think the time is where it should be. You know, we're not bagging the plugs out or anything. I took a lot of weight off the clutches, but, like, dude, I'm telling you, just now, it left. It left. They about to come out. Last pad, baby. George, send it. I'm yeah. telling I, I bet you we put that 33 on it. I bet you it'll rev high going to the eight. But I wonder what the, like, what I've been trying to figure out is the advantages of going. See the situation. That, you heard it just now? Still has one side. Well, that ain't never good. Go ahead. Man, this bike hates me. I want to get on. I hope not. The spark plugs are going to tell us. Yep. I got it right. Oh, yep. All right. Let's take some more time out of that one. For sure. Yeah. I just hope this all turns the plug. This one's good. No, I ain't got no hole. Oh, you sure? Yeah, man. Oh, come on. I don't know what this is. It's my I don't know if that's a hole or not. Shit, I'm here for him, got that big gun, bitch, no, we still scoring, yeah, yeah. Still missing Dottie, banging that little quiz, turn me up.